In this video, I will teach you and demonstrate on how you can fully load up and jailbreak your Fire Stick for the best entertainment experience. So some might call it jailbreaking. It's actually just sideloading your Fire Stick with the best app store and applications out there. I'm going to walk you through everything. It's going to be a step by step guide. But before we start, I would like to ask you to follow each step very carefully and fully till the end for the best results. So let's not waste any more time and let's dive in right away. The first thing that you want to do is you want to head over to your settings gear all the way to the right on your Fire Stick. Go ahead and scroll down until you see my Fire TV. There you want to press OK on the navigation button and you want to click OK again to enter the about section. Here you'll have a few options. The top option is going to be Fire TV Stick. For you, it might say something else depending on your Fire Stick model, but that's totally fine. You want to click on it seven times on the navigation button. After seven times, you'll become a developer. I'm currently already a developer, so for me, it's totally fine. But after you've done it seven times, you can press back and you will see the developer options appearing in your settings. We'll come back here later. For now, you can go ahead and press the home button on your remote control. And we're going to go ahead and search for an application to download. It's going to be called Downloader. You just need to type in the D. It pops up for me automatically, uh, hopefully for you too. You can go ahead and scroll down, click OK on it to enter it. It's going to be this orange app. You can click OK on the navigation button again and one more time to confirm you want to download and install it on your Fire Stick. It's going to go ahead and do that. Uh, you don't need to do anything. Um, just wait for it patiently and after it's done, you can click OK again on the na navigation button and it will open up the app. It's going to pop up a message to allow access. Uh, you're going to press OK to allow it. You're going to click OK again and you'll be entered in this app. You have the option to go ahead and click on the search bar. And now you can either type in a site or a code. That's the whole purpose of Downloader. Instead of using a long website, you can use a code. Uh, before we continue here, we're going to press on the home button. We're going to go back to our settings gear. And it's not going to be the last time, by the way. We're going to go back to our My Fire TV and we're going to enter developer options. It's going to be this right here. You want to go to install unknown apps, scroll down. And you want to toggle on install unknown apps from Downloader. What this does is it will let us install applications through the downloader app we just installed. That's all this is. Go ahead and open up the app. It's going to be all the way here. And we're going to go to the search bar. Click OK on the notification button and you, are, you want to type in a code. The code is going to be 10381. And you want to go ahead and press either play or go to the go button right there. It's going to automatically connect us to this web page. Um, it's going to lo load it up. You don't need to do anything. Just patiently wait. It's automatically going to go ahead and connect to the app and then download it. It's going to pop up this mes message to go ahead and install it. You want to press the down arrow and then the right to go on the install button and press OK. It's going to go ahead and install it for us. That's how easy this is. After it's installed, uh, you don't need to open it yet. We're going to press the home button again on our remote control and you want to go back to the settings gear. Go ahead and do that. Then you want to scroll down and you want to continue again to my Fire TV. You'll be redirected back to install unknown apps. You want to press back the back arrow and press OK again to enter it. And now you will see that new app also appearing. And you want to confirm and toggle this on also that we will be able to install unknown apps through this application right here. This application is going to be the side loading part where you'll get the opportunity to enter a new app store with the best applications out there. Uh, some you might have come across before and some you haven't that are actually very good. Uh, let's go ahead and open it up. It's going to be here. Okay. And here you'll get the opportunity to add a library. That's the option. So you have the app. Now you need the app uh, add a library. And this works almost the same like the download application. You can press OK and OK again. It will open up the keyboard and you can either type in a code or a name. Uh, this app store that we are going to be entering today is going to have everything you need to take your entertainment machine to a whole new level. And that's why it's also called everything. Type in as how you spell it. And after that is done. I'm not that fast, by the way. Let's uh, wait patiently, please. 
there you go and where it is there you go and you can uh, press play again to confirm it it's gonna load it up and now we're entering a new app store what you want to do here is you want to read the message very important uh there will be a category with uh players in this app store it's gonna be currently i believe two apps um to use those and this is the number one app this is the one that i use every day to use these you do need to subscribe um there will be a link in this welcoming message you want to go ahead and visit it if you want to experience that what i'm experiencing you want to go ahead and purchase uh, one right there uh it will offer you the best and amazing quality you can get um so but that's up to you because a lot of apps here are free they're all free actually and um this is going to be the it's all categorized and there's one called best players there you want to go ahead and uh, download one of these two uh, or more there'll probably be more but these are the ones that i use they work on phones tablets tvs depending on what kind of tv you have most tvs they work on either one or the, the other works on it and um that being said we can go ahead and demonstrate on how to install one of these apps let's go ahead and download a tool uh for this demonstration we'll be using task killer it's going to go ahead and kill all background applications to free up memory you want to go to the app you want to install just click ok on it it will pop up the message to download this app go ahead and click ok to confirm and it will pop up quickly after that another message to install the app if you want to click ok again to confirm it's going to pop up the same menu you get all the time you want to scroll down and right to go to the install button click ok and it's going to go ahead and install this app for us that being said we can press the home button and we can search for the app we just installed and this again gonna kill all background apps it's right there it's gonna be the blue icon you can press ok on it and it will automatically close all background apps it will tell you how how much memory it has released and it will yeah make your fire stick a bit faster that being said i think we walked through everything we need um if you have any questions for me or any feedback i encourage leave it for me i'm always eager to learn more uh please do that being said this video has come to an end thank you for watching and see you in the next one